Welcome to one of our Alpha Laval 360 degree service and maintenance videos. With Alpha Laval service, you maximize the reliability and uptime of your equipment. The result is superior performance throughout the equipment life cycle. Performance that puts you ahead of competition. Here we will focus on how to conduct service and maintenance on the standard Alpha Laval LKH centrifugal pump range using our service kits with genuine spare parts. Remember, always read the instruction manual thoroughly to cover all maintenance steps, since this video only shows you some of the steps. To maintain the standard Alpha Laval LKH centrifugal pump range, these tools are required. Each Alpha Laval service kit contains all the spare parts you need. How to change a flushed shaft seal and product wetted seals. Remove the two flush connections. Unscrew the nuts. Remove the washers and then remove the back plate. Remove the rotating seal arrangement from stub shaft. Remove the rotating seal from the spring. Remove the O-ring from the rotating seal. Remove the O-ring from the drive ring. Remove the casing O-ring from the back plate. Remove the stationary seal from the back plate and then remove the O-ring. Remove the screws and the seal housing and then remove the O-ring. Pull out the lip seal from the seal housing. Lubricate the O-ring and slide it onto the back plate. Lubricate and fit the O-ring on the stationary seal ring. Screw the stationary seal ring into the back plate. Lubricate the O-ring and fit it onto the flushed housing. Lubricate the O-ring and fit it internally in the drive ring. Lubricate the O-ring and fit it internally in the rotating seal ring. Using a 63mm pipe and a wise, fit the lip seal into the seal housing.
fit the seal housing on the back plate and tighten the screws. Fit the rotating seal ring onto the spring and drive ring. Ensure that the driver on the drive ring fits into the notch in the rotating seal ring. Fit the complete shaft seal onto the stub shaft. Make sure that the conix pin on the stub shaft fits into the notch in the drive ring. Carefully guide the back plate onto the adapter. Fit the washers and nuts and then tighten them. Fit the flushed connection pipes. Lubricate the impeller hub with silicon grease or oil. Screw the impeller onto the stub shaft. Fit the impeller screw and then tighten it. Fit the safety guards and then screw and tighten them. Fit the pump casing, washers and cap nuts. Tighten the cap nuts according to the torque values in the instruction manual. 